We are now going to begin or continue with our part modeling and we're going to create pin 2. Very similar to pin 1. The only difference is the extrusion is, is now going to be 0.5 as opposed to 0.75. So what we'll do is we'll simply close pin 1. We'll simply click on the new. We'll choose the standard inch IPT file inventor part file. Click OK. And once again, we'll begin with the same process. Click on circle. Click for the center point of the circle. Drag out the circle. Left click again. Choose our dimension tool from along the top here. Click on the edge of the circle. Drag our dimension out. And we simply click on the dimension and we enter the dimension we want, which is 0.13. Press enter or click the green OK button. Once again, I'm going to move my view into an isometric view by simply moving to the view cube, clicking on the little home icon there. Zoom out with my wheel mouse. I can also click and hold my wheel mouse and just pan that over. We are finished sketching, so we make our way to the finished sketch tool up along the top right. Click on the big green check mark, click finish sketch. We are now going to use the same 3D tool, feature tool called Extrude. It once again automatically finds the profile we wish to extrude. We're going to enter the value of 0.5. Click on OK and we now have pin 2 created. So we simply click on the save button and call it pin 2.